And we remain on the matter. The United States Justice Department has filed a lawsuit against the state of Texas, arguing that its new abortion law was enacted in open defiance of the Constitution. The law, which is the most restrictive in the country, has sparked international condemnation. The Justice Department is seeking a judgment declaring the Texas abortion ban invalid, as well as a preliminary and permanent injunction against the state of Texas. The law, which bans abortions from the time a heartbeat can be detected, which is usually around six weeks and before most women know they are pregnant, does not provide exceptions for cases of rape or incest. It also means that private citizens can bring private litigation against clinics and anyone else who assists a woman in obtaining an abortion after six weeks. Experts know the Texas law was designed specifically with the goal of making it more difficult for clinics to obtain federal court orders blocking its enforcement. The same kind of provisions to deprive its citizens of their constitutional rights and in particular... The act is clearly unconstitutional under long-standing Supreme Court precedent. Those precedents hold, in the words of Planned Parenthood versus Casey, that, quote, Regardless of whether exceptions are made for particular circumstances, a state may not prohibit any woman from making the ultimate decision to terminate her pregnancy before viability. The Department of Justice has a duty to defend the Constitution of the United States and to uphold the rule of law. Today, we fulfill that duty by filing the lawsuit I have just described. 